Mr. Tan Kin Lian says he looks forward to a constructive relationship with Prime Minister Lee Sen Lung if he is elected. And he intends to influence the government within the stipulations of the constitution. A high five denotes the five values that Mr. Tan Kin Lian is campaigning on. They represent honesty, fairness, positive attitude, courage and public service. Supporters say they are rallying behind the ex-NQC income chief as they believe in those values. It's a steady, consistent, uh, proactive, highly innovative person. I believe his uh, uh, five values will be good for Singaporeans. Mr Tan said he views himself as being the only neutral and non-partisan candidate. He also wants to follow in the footsteps of late former President Ong Ting Chiang. President Ong uh, knows his duty as a president to safeguard the reserves. He does his best to act independently, uh, to ask questions. Uh, in that, I will follow his example. The constitution does not say the president cannot listen to people and bring their concerns to the government. And this is what I want to do. And I want to tell the people, have the courage to vote for me, and I will have the courage to do what has to be done. Mr Tan said he has a shoestring budget of about $50,000 for his campaign. Some 2,000 posters will be put up at various parts of Singapore. He will also be stepping up his outreach activities by meeting people at MRT stations, food courts and attending community events. On his upcoming presidential candidate broadcast, Mr Tan said his first broadcast will touch on what he wants to do in this campaign, while the second is likely to be on his vision for Singapore. Well, Mr Tan said he will be having his first rally next Wednesday at Yeo Chu Kang Stadium and he'll also be extending his outreach by having indoor rallies. Now, that's online streaming sessions where voters can share their views and concerns with him.